so this is very exciting for me. I was here last week. What a famous movie, and it's now on stage. In Liverpool, Dirty Dancing, and two of the stars are with me. I've got the lovely Claire who plays Penny. Yes. And yeah. Johnny, uh, yeah. you're played by Lewis. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Lewis, yeah. you're played, yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah. 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 Confused already. <laughs> yeah. Totally. Start with you, because you play the, the character which is very famous, obviously. Yes, yeah. Patrick Swayze. Patrick Swayze in the film, yes. Yeah, the yeah. pressure must be on for you, mate. Do you know what? They're pretty big shoes, uh, yeah, pretty big shoes to fill. But um, but actually, when you when you get out there and you sort of, um, you feel that audience sort of anticipation and building up, it's, it's just such a nice character to play. Mm. And I, I really enjoy it, so it's, it's good to be a part. And the, the screams and the, the yell from some of the ladies in Liverpool. Oh, they can only do good things for my ego, so, uh, <laughs> so yeah, no, so it's, it's Have good. you ever had any, any knickers thrown at stage? Or um, I've had a couple of gropes, even at this theatre as well, uh, walking down the aisles, a cu couple of cheeky bum grabs, um, but yeah, no, no, no knickers, just, yeah. Right. Well, that's, that's still, you've still got a few weeks left here. Yeah, totally. could, could happen, could yeah, happen. Totally. Uh, let's talk about Dirty Dancing, because obviously it's a massive movie. We all love yes. it, girls and boys. Yes. What was it like when you got told you're going to be in Dirty Dancing? Um, do you know, it really was a dream come true because I grew up with the film like most people and it was, it, and still is, one of my favourite films. So um, when, I, when I knew that I was going to be playing Penny, um, I was absolutely over the moon mm. and my family were so happy for me because there, there aren't really many shows out there like Dirty Dancing. It's got such a huge following. And really it is a great story you know there's so many things in the in in this show and in the film that people relate to and i think that's why it's timeless and i think that's why we're up on stage performing this show now and the music as well is it's special isn't it yeah. i remember yeah. being 14 and listening to like hungry eyes yeah, and people, she's like it, the it wind it doesn't it's date no. it just doesn't date people i mean when you turn on the radio you the songs are still playing you know, and this film came out in the 80s, but um, they are great songs. And I think that's, again, one of the draws to the show, that when people come, this is all live. So we've mm. got a live band. So all of those sort of hits and the, those really classic, iconic songs, they're all live. Mm. So it's it kind of it really does bring it to life for people, I think. How are you finding Liverpool? Because you've been here a week now. We, yeah. it, it runs until... Which the 25th. So it's got a, yeah. it's still got a couple of weeks Yes, left. we've got a yeah. couple of weeks. So um, April the 25th. How are you finding Scousers? Oh, it's great. And yeah. the, the atmosphere and the, and the energy that, that the, uh, the audiences bring to us it really really does sort of give us a lift. And, it, and, it's, and it's nice to hear, hear the, that reaction uh, yeah. for the show. Um, and yeah, they're all lovely and friendly, and it's just nice I to think, be around here, actually. Yeah, I think Scousers have got more energy than we have yeah. on stage. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen a few of that, a few of that happening on um, last Thursday. Yeah. A few ladies with a few bottles of wine. Very good. But yeah. it was brilliant. It was all good fun. Yeah, it, it is. Great. It really is all good fun, and we want them to have, a, you know, a really good night. Yeah. So it kind of makes a difference for us if we know they're really enjoying it. It's, it's obviously, it's great for us. Mm. The guys are rehearsing, I won't keep you too much longer, the guys are rehearsing on stage now. Yes. Yeah. Do you guys have to have to train and rehearse every day? Because obviously there's some really vigorous moves in it. Yeah, in, show. In, terms of, in terms of some of the lifts in the show and things like that, we do do that before the show, sort of every night, just to mm -hmm. go through and make sure that's all safe. Um, and then in terms of the, the, the numbers and the big dance numbers, we go through that and, and just work things out together so that every night it becomes fluid. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, we do, we do do a lot of rehearsing. And yeah. You must have like muscles of steel. <laughs> <too>. <laughs> Well, I think it does come, you know, obviously with the show, you have to look mm. after yourself and eat well and sleep well and, and uh, yeah, because otherwise you couldn't sustain it every single mm. night. But we do have a nice time as well, you know, we kind of, we enjoy the, the backstage uh, fun and everything, yeah, you know. I can so imagine it's a giggle too. Yes, yes we yeah. do. Let's yeah. talk about just a couple of things in the film. I won't spoil this for, for anyone that's going to come and see this at the Empire. There's a couple of moments that I was like, Wow, that is incredible how they've kind of translated that from film to stage. Yes. I'm talking about, about certain dance moves on a, on a tree, yeah, I'm talking yeah, about yeah, water yeah. scenes. It's amazing. Yeah. yeah. So has that been in the show since, since the beginning? Yes, yes. We've got a, a brilliant creative team that have managed mm. to adapt the film and stage version just effortlessly mm. um, with modern technology and projection and everything like that. So all of those um, favourite 
moments in the, the film, they are on they stage. Never got so cut. they They're didn't get there. cut, so yeah. you will get to see them. So um, it's very clever, very, very clever. Right, we're here in, in kind of the hub backstage. This is where it all happens. Yes. I'm presuming there's, there's body parts flying everywhere <laughs> yeah. when the show oh, is on here. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so, so show us around this. This is the, the costume. So this area, is actually right. the ladies' quick change area. So um, this is where we come to change from scene to scene. Um, these are actually some of my costumes. Um, and there's That's this, a famous dress for Penny, This isn't is it? quite yeah. a famous dress. Yes, I do most of my big dance numbers mm. in this. Um, but just the design and, and the work that goes into them is, is incredible. So, mm. you know, we're lucky that we get to wear such uh, beautiful costumes every night. And I'm seeing a Hawaiian dress here. Which yes. Is from a scene that you've, yes. all, you've all heard of. And the that hula. song is in the show as well. Yes, and the, actually it's it, the audience love that. It's hysterical, and, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's great. But there's lots that goes on back here. This is kind of like the second show mm. um, from what's going on out the front. So there's lots of stuff. With, there's wig changes, costume changes, hairspray and you know you can smell the lacquer yeah, actually yeah you can, can smell the Lewis what about you I'm not yeah. seeing any any male costumes so, so this is all the, the the females quick change so, area right, and okay. there's a male section over there as well but um and mine and mine are all packed away at the moment but um, yeah so I've got a lot of my costumes are actually in my dressing room because I do my, some of my changes in there as well mm. some of them are side stage so take everything off chuck everything back on and get back out there so some of the changes are very quick it's a lot easier for you than the more it is for, for you yeah, Claire, yeah. yes and because yeah. obviously i don't have to wear any wigs or anything like that so for me it's just a quick uh, flick of the hair and then back yeah, out yeah, there yeah. again so uh, and it, we wouldn't be able to do it i mean we have a whole team of dressers so you know everything runs very smoothly because we've got really such a great backstage yeah. team. who help you out yes. how many all together do we know so in the Including entire cast. company we must tour with around Four or five, maybe four, four or five in, in what, terms dresses? of yeah, I dresses. Mean, but for the entire company, how many people do we tour with? Oh, forty I don't know. people, wow. maybe. Yeah, probably plus, yeah. Amazing. Yeah, forty plus. Is yeah, there even that yeah. many people in the in the actual film? Well, the whole. <laughs> yeah, <I know>. It's amazing. <laughs> I mean, there's lots that that goes on backstage that that to, one to keep us safe. But I mean, without our backstage crew, um, the show just wouldn't mm. happen. So we're kind of fifty percent of what of the actual running of the show. Mm. Um, so yeah, there's a big team of people that come together just to get one show on and yeah. just, you know, for everything to work so sort of seamlessly. You Tough know. question for you both, and you've both got to answer it. What's your favorite song in Dirty Dancing? Um, I would say, Do You Love Me? Uh, and yes. I just feel up like because it evokes so much sort of um, fun and energy and, and you can really sort of get into it and uh, as, as, a, as a number to dance as well you can really sort of have a bit of fun yeah. Um, and yeah really react off each other as well which is good it's a good number. Claire? Uh, mine's Love Man. Which one's Love Man? Um, it's, it's, it comes in the show just after it's in the same scene um, and it comes after Do You Love Me but it's a real soul song Great. and, um, and Colin Charles sings it who is yeah. just incredible yes, so I've seen yeah he's yeah he's brilliant. brilliant he's brilliant well listen um thank you. one more thing before you go and get on stage can you teach me any 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 moves i'm Absolutely. not going to ask for the lift because i'll probably break my back <laughs> just something really simple <laughs> i've never danced in my life by the way okay well we'll teach you something that we do in in our mumbo dance okay so um you can be Lewis, but so what we'll do is we'll, you Johnny. can be, yeah. you wow. can be Johnny. <laughs> Made up. So um, this is what we do. We would start in a in a frame. Okay. So this is kind of the base for everything in a way. You have to have really good solid frame. Right. So then we start with they're called basic mumbos. Right. So you would go. You do. You copy exactly what Lewis does, and then we do a side. Mm. And side. <laughs> How am I going to do this? <laughs> right. Okay. Lewis, can I ask so you to hold the mic? Of course you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me get in there. So my arm goes. Yeah. So I'm going to yes. sit in the So you want to bring your arm higher up and keep okay. your, yeah. That's it. your frame solid. And now what? Now what do so I do? So no now? spaghetti arms. Remember that. Okay, no spaghetti arms. <laughs> <laughs> You're talking to the lankiest bears in the Liverpool, by the way. Okay, here okay, we go. Okay, so you need to start with your feet so together. So I put my feet up. You would be, you would be flat, wouldn't you? Flat, yep, feet. flat feet. Flat feet. Okay. So your feet would be together. So you're gonna, I'm gonna go back. You're gonna come forward. This is a disaster waiting <laughs> to happen. Let's, so let's try you go. It. Other leg. You start with so your you other step leg. On your so that one. Left. Yeah, yep. that's the one. That's and it. then back. Together. Oh and then back on your right. And then back on your right. Um, I can't do it. I can't do it. Do you know you what? I'm, I'm going to give up now. Are you going to give up? I am. Go on, let's try one let's more try. time. Okay, go on. so we go and you go forwards. Yeah. Back. 
and then side to the left. Side. That's it. And then to the right. And then side. to the right. That's it. <laughs> See all the bum wiggling that you're doing. <laughs> that's that's put me off, but that was that was good. I could maybe I mean, work on that start. and see what happens. It was, it was yeah. a good start. Brilliant. Well, thank you for chatting. I love thank your you. your jumpers, by the way, with the dirty dancing brand. Oh, yeah. I'm actually out of breath. <laughs> <laughs> uh, enjoy the rest of the run. Thank and you. Get out in Liverpool because it's great. Yeah, we'd love to. Yes, we thank will. you guys. Definitely. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm in the time of my life. No Okay, so I'm going to be honest, I'm not going to lie, I am absolutely knackered after that dance move, but not only that, the, the million and one stairs of the Empire Theatre, uh, but we've come to the wig room, this is pretty special in terms yes. of dirty dancing, isn't it? Yes, it is. This is kind of where, where we're all sort of transformed and um, we've got um, a brilliant wig team that set all the wigs to the style of the, it was the early 60s, mm. obviously, that, that um, dirty dancing is set. So um, there's a whole wig design um, team and they design all of the styles. Everyone is different and everyone has... Some people just have one, some people have two, some people have three wigs. How many have you got? So how many does, does Penny have? So I just have one style for the show. Right. Um, and the hair is all real hair. They, I mean, they are, they're beautiful wigs. How does it feel to dance with someone like that? Because obviously... I'm not saying you get sweaty at all, but <laughs> you know you, you're dancing a lot. Is, is, yeah, it you get like you get used to it actually, and and to be honest, it it kind of becomes like it's your own hair, mm. um, you know. And but when you first start wearing them, I mean, I have a I have a mic pack and right. everything in the back of my head. So when you first start, it feels like your head feels really heavy. You've got all this hair that isn't yours. Um, but you just get used to it, you know, it, it becomes part so of the show. not only have you got to do the dancing like I've just done, you've, you've got all that to contend with as yeah. well. You guys work hard. We were just talking off camera about watching a show like this and you're kind of knackered by the end because you're buzzing so much and you guys must be yeah. so tired, but there's so much more before the show yes. that happens. There's a lot of in... prep, actually, um, and I think more than people know. Um, certainly for the wig department, they, they work late, they start early because mm. the hair has to be washed, uh -huh. set, styled, and then it has to all be looked after again at the end of the show. Mm. So... Um, there is so much that does go into one show, you know, like the sound department are in, all the uh, safety checks, our physical and vocal warm up, um, and then our rehearsal time, then the time to have all of our wigs and makeup and everything. So, um, yeah, it is. There's, there's. Does anything ever change? So day to day, does the director or producer ever think, you know, what we're going to cut that scene or we're going to change that? Or we don't. Like, can um, you do we that? don't cut scenes, um, and but. Certainly when the creative team come in, um, we don't change the script or anything like that, but certainly things um, are kept fresh. Mm. And, and, and if the choreographer comes in and, and may want to tweak certain moves, and you know, that does happen. It does happen. And, and we get notes. We have dance captains and a resident director that watch nice. each show, and so we get notes. Because when you do something, you know, eight times a week without even realising things change yeah. and they slip into different ways and you say things differently. So we've got a team that watch and note the show and we wow. get notes every day. So there's we always something. We should really something. start doing that on our show, <laughs> producer behind the camera. That'd be a good idea, that. It is, it works. It's, <laughs> it's good. I bet it does. Let's talk about these wigs because this, yes. this is your wig. This is one of mine. So um, she's now set in rollers and will be ready. I'll wear this piece tonight. Proper Scouse girl material. Yes, that. I know. Um, I love this. When, <laughs> when I've been out in uh, Liverpool and the girls are in the their rollers. rollers. It's yeah. very glamorous. It's Have you it's been very, on an easy jet glamorous. flight yet? Yeah. No. It's full of, full of rollers, full of rollers. <laughs> so some, some of these wigs, have we got baby's wig here? So or? this is this is baby's wig. Great. Um, that when, when, uh, when she wears this, she really does transform into baby. I mean, it is quite incredible. Mm. I know you've seen the, the she's, show. She's the ringer, she is the spit. Yes. But believe it or not, when you see her in real life, she's got long brown hair and right. you would never compare her to Jennifer Grey. But as soon as she's got you know this amazing wig and makeup and everything it really does transform mm. people so a lot of the time when we come out after the show people wouldn't even know that it that it was us yeah. that was just doing the show so um that's, that's why it is these, so these that's ladies are. yes yeah. very You've very talented 
Yes. Well, listen, well done. You were going to let you get back to work. Thanks you know, you've got a lot much. to do. Can I just get something done to my ginger wig before we leave? <laughs> no. no? Got to stay ginger again. forever. Yeah, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. Nothing wrong with ginger. Well, strawberry blonde, I like to call it. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for chatting to us. And thank you. Enjoy thank the rest you. of Liverpool. Thank you. Um, just one reason why people should buy tickets for Dirty Dancing. Because um, you'll have the time of your life. Perfect. Perfect way to end. It's on the Empire Theatre until the 25th. Get your tickets now. Claire, place Penny, thank you. Thank you.